I'm Matt from eSpares. Now if you've damaged the cable, or the cable reel mechanism is no longer working, on your Hetty or Henry vacuum cleaner, that's dead easy to fix. Here we have the cable reel moulding, we've got a replacement cable, and a cable reel cover. I'm going to show you how to fit all three parts to this Hetty. But the process is very similar for other models of pneumatic cleaner that have this cable reel mechanism. Let's start by taking Hetty's hat off. And we just need to undo these four screws on the outside to separate the two parts. Okay, let's just separate out the motor and put that to one side and then lift out the reel. So here we have the cable reel moulding, the cable and the cable reel cover. Now obviously you're only going to need to replace whichever part is broken. For this demonstration I'm going to actually replace all three parts. However, I am going to need these three screws from the old one. So I'll start by taking those out. Okay, now the only other things that I need to rescue from the old mechanism is this cable entry here, which slots in there, and this capacitor which sits between the two terminals. So we have our cable entry, our three screws, and the capacitor. They're all available to buy on the eSpares website if you do need to replace any of those. So let's start off by putting the capacitor between the two terminals as we had it on the old one. Okay, so now we can attach the cable. You should be able to see that they are labelled live and neutral, but before we do that, do make sure you put the cable entry over the end of the cable, get it the right way round. Let's start with the brown cable going into live and tighten that up. And then blue into the neutral terminal. The cable should come pre-stripped, so it is fairly easy to do. Now, we just need to feed the cable through the top of the moulding. Just follow the arrows, and that anchors the cable nicely in place. There we go. Uh, we can then put the cover on. Just need to line up the holes. And put the three holding screws in. There we go. Just need to wind the cable back onto the reel. Okay, now we just reassemble the unit. There's your cable entry slots in there, and then we can replace this with the motor. Do it before holding screws, and that's the last screw in place. Now we can pop Hetty's hat back on. That should be one working cable mechanism. So all those parts are available on the eSpares website. Thank you very much for watching.